Purdue Solar Racing Team recently won high marks in a national competition with their latest solar car that gets nearly 2,400 miles per gallon equivalency. News Channel 18's Aaron Leedy caught up with some of the team members today. Aaron, how well did they do? First place, Nicole, we introduced you to their latest vehicle, Soleritas, a couple weeks ago. Now that car is gaining national attention for its top performance. We always have a backup plan, so uh, we took that into Houston, uh, and it worked out great. Purdue Solar Racing Team is back from Houston, Texas for the fourth year in a row. Purdue has claimed a first place title each year they've competed. This trip was their first time competing with their newest vehicle, Soleritas. First few days down there, we were uh, basically not sleeping at all, trying to get the car ready, working out some bugs with the uh, uh, with the solar cells. Once the bugs were worked out, the team was back on track to its top prize goal. Seventy teams from across the U.S. competed in categories for solar, diesel, and hydrogen power. Shell's Eco Marathon takes place in downtown Houston, giving the team a real-life driving experience. You really got that urban feel. Um, the urban atmosphere, you know, things like potholes in the road and, you know, stop and go at stoplights. The Shell Eco Marathon is based on total efficiency, not speed, but the team must keep the car above 20 miles per hour. When the competition was over, the team won first place in the urban concept design category for most miles per gallon equivalency. Urban concept meaning create a car that looks like something you would see on the road. The more the team does well in these competitions, the more the university and sponsors notice. Sponsors always keeping an eye out, keeping an eye out whether it's for material donations, uh, monetary donations. So they're always looking, uh, looking at what we're doing, and they're consistently being impressed. And Pacina says the team learned a lot, but there's still room for improvement. They'll enter Soleritas in next year's competition, and the team is already talking about plans for their next solar car. Aaron Leedy, News Channel 18.